Hi, my name is Neil Waters. I'm a graduate student here at San Jose State University's School of Journalism and Mass Communications. I'm currently getting my master's degree in mass communications. I think the thing that's always appealed to me about photography is that perfect marriage of technology and that science aspect with creativity. You have to know your camera, you have to know you know, how to use the technology in order to capture an image that, that looks aesthetically pleasing. So you have to understand the art part of it too. You have to understand how to use all the computer tools if you're going to create an image that actually looks good and is pleasing and is publishable. Both halves of the brain are satisfied. <laughs> I didn't finish my undergrad until 2007. Spent about two years working for a company, doing some programming in Unix administration with them. And that's when I thought, you know, I, what somebody needs to do is figure out what the next generation news organization that exists on the internet is gonna look like and how it's gonna operate and function. And I thought, I'll go back to school and I'll do my master's degree and I'll look at that problem as best I can and try to figure out if I can come up with a solution. And that's where I'm at right now. Coming to San Jose State and having access to Creative Cloud as a student in the Journalism and Mass Communication School was a real bonus. About a year ago, I created a digital magazine here at the university called South Bay Pulse. South Bay Pulse is a digital arts and entertainment magazine. However, we also try to get in a couple of in-depth stories and it's published through Adobe's digital publishing tools. We use InDesign as our primary design platform for that, but then we also use Premiere Pro and we use Illustrator and we use Photoshop to create all of the assets that go into the publishing. It's been a lot of fun because I've had the opportunity to see what it's like to actually create a digital publication and then put it out there into the world and see how people react to it and watch our readership grow. But more importantly, it's been fun to watch the undergraduates within the journalism program start to see, oh, this is a whole new way of presenting stories and news and content. I definitely feel like a lot of this multimedia content production is gonna be the future. And I think that that's how we're gonna tell stories and that's how people want to get stories. It's very hard to do that kind of work these days without relying on Adobe's Creative Cloud. It's become very integral to the process of creating multimedia content. Having the experience of creating a digital magazine using Adobe's Creative Cloud, I was actually able to find something different that I didn't expect. So in one room, in one publication, I was a programmer, I was a Unix administrator, I was a back-end web developer, I was a photographer, I was a writer. For the first time in my career, all of my skill sets came together in one place. Creative Cloud will be a very large part of what I do moving forward.